A relation? Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, distinguish the legal profession from business? Yeah. As an officer of the court? Yes. To the administration of justice involving thorough sincerity, integrity, and reliability? Hmm. A relation to clients with the highest degree of fiduciary? Oh. A relation to the colleagues at the bar characterized by candor? Yes. Fairness and unwillingness to resort to mm -hmm, current business methods of advertising and encroachment on their practice or dealing directly with their clients. Yes. Now, these are called legal ethics. Mm -hmm. See, when you issue a protection order where you intentionally don't have any jurisdiction. Yeah. And you don't have my name anywhere in the docket for the last eight years. Yes. And then you serve me. Uh-huh. But you violate all the laws of pretty much every state. Yes. And then I inform those in law enforcement, uh huh, lawyers, yes, law schools, mm -hmm. bar associations, yes, that there's a legal, ethical problem with the profession that refuses to acknowledge the need of a name. Now, you've been using dockets, 180 million of them, yes. Exactly how much, um, well, precedence is necessary to establish a case, pooch. See, I think you've actually been changing the content of various document or case setting cases where you thought, well, I'm going to make a little adjustment to a couple of the words. Yes. And then I'm going to include that with my petition of the court. Yes. So that the judge will read it the way that I want the judge to see it. Yes. Now, here's an example. Yes. Disregard. <laughs> mm -hmm. The action of ignoring or treating without proper respect or consideration. <laughs> The quality, state, or condition of being ignored mm -hmm. or treated without proper respect or consideration. Yes. Reckless disregard, conscience in, conscious indifference to the consequences of an act. <laughs> Defamation, serious indifference to truth mm -hmm. or accuracy of publication. Yes. Now, I gave you the example of the use of my name. Mm -hmm. I could say it's defamation to put my name in the paper, even though it's Bishop. Yes. That you keep saying is such a tremendous football star mm -hmm. when you don't have parental consent for them to play football. Mm -hmm. Now, I would consider it a defamation <clears throat> where you keep putting the name Budnick in the newspaper. Yes. Without me receiving any actual notice of court hearings. Yes. And then when I inform the legal profession of the ethical consequences of this, mm, it's as if you'd recklessly disregard the needs of the enforcement of the laws. Now, conscious indifference to the consequences of an act. Yes. Mm. Now, you thought it was so good, yes, that you're going to put the Bud nickname in newspapers mm, when I just informed you, yes, of the conscious disregard for the actual needs of the laws to be in. <laughs> mm -hmm.